Hello, my lovely Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Let's get some messages to you. What does your person want to say to you at this time? I have I love you, Scorpios. And, you know, when I, uh, before I record, guys, I clear out the decks and I sage and I use sage by doing that. When I tell you, Scorpios, the sage literally, oh, sorry, I almost hit the camera, <laughs> almost blew up in my face. Like, there's a lot of clearing out that you or this person needs to do or honestly, the both of you guys, Scorpio. So, we're going to see what's going on here. A lot of emotions, yeah. I can see anger, I can see love, I can see regret, I can see pain all over this reading here. This keeps wanting, yeah. Um, I need to be clear with you. I want to be clear with you right now. Type of energy. It's like an urgency here, which is why I feel like the sage almost blew up in my face. That could be why. But I have I love you. The thought of you with someone makes them angry. I think about you in public, hoping to see you. I replay our conversations over and over, Scorpios. I'm starting to understand the, our connection. I didn't really realize how bad it hurts you until now here. And that's what that's what's aching them to clear this up, okay? I wonder who has your attention right now, Scorpios, and I never stop loving you. Again, I look for you everywhere, hoping to see you in public. I feel you leaving me behind. And again, that urge if I just need to say something to you, you know, being there, you're kind of intoxicating. The timing wasn't right for us. And I just want to clear some things up. I can't stop thinking about you. And again, I cannot wait any longer. Please respond. So, um, Scorpios, those are sense of urgency to get to you. Yeah, Grim Reaper, the relationship is over. No second chance is growing, transformed your life. I feel like Scorpios, even with the Ace of Swords coming up too, like you, you cut them off. Yeah, yeah, look at that X. You cut them. Wow, you cut them off, Scorpio. Silent treatment of Bandit. You said, forget that, Rogue. I'm focusing on me. <laughs> I'm going to love me. And that's what you did for some of you. You haven't yet. Do so. I have not enough frustrated in relationship, lack of confidence, self sabotage, fear, ego issues, jealousy. Yeah, wondering who has your attention because the thought of you with someone makes them angry. They're jealous that you cut them off for some of you. Uh, or again, they're going to clear some things up that. Um, I feel like you didn't see, right? Missing you, nostalgia, making new memories, hair, Scorpio. So, wow. Let's get into this reading for sure. But I feel like Scorpio's, you know, for a lot of you, you are done and you're moving on to some new love here. Yeah, you're walking away from this. And it hit them hard and unexpectedly here. Three of Cups energy is in reverse and the Four of Swords, okay? I have the Page of Swords and the Nine of Swords. It could be a third party in interference that got in the way. I see a child and a mom here, Page of Cups and the Queen of Cups. If it doesn't have to be a child situation here with the three of cups energy this could simply be you, you are showing up as the queen of cups scorpios in your energy literally and they're showing up at this little ass page and it's like no you want your queen to the king and vice versa here so for some of you you blocked them out and this was a really um it really shattered, shattered their ego here scorpio so yeah that's what I thought of you with someone that makes them angry for some of you. I have the two of wands and nine of swords. They're howling seems this nice for sure. And again, it's like with the eight of wands energy just um rushing towards you here. Thinking about you in public, hoping to see you. So again, you know, they could be relying on divine fate at this time because like I said, you cut them off. They yeah, there's another child that kept coming in. But again, it doesn't have to be it's just that for some they they egged you on and didn't take the risk to step up to the plate to um move on to the next level level in your relationship and it's like they backstabbed themselves because you were telling them what you wanted and you gave them so many chances here for some of you scorpios and it was like you know what enough is enough like i want a firm and stable foundation if you can't give me that hair then it's time to go you did some some of you if you're uh have Virgo on your chart you did you did that with no hesitation like i said for some um there was a third party here the tower i want to get back to this tower moment because it's like really strong right now Nine of Pentacles. yeah knowing they need to heal not being selfish anymore but trying to rush and dealing with their aquarius energy yeah, yeah again there's some things i need to get off my chest i'm hurting i'm regretting a lot but here you are with your boundaries um up and look at that their boundaries are down type energy so you know i'll replay our conversations conversations over and over here you know, air sign energy, cancer energy. It's like the worst has already happened. I'm getting my karma because the voice is like you were telling them like, hey, if you don't step up, basically I'm out. Or why don't you do this? Or it'll be helpful if you do this. Like you have a very caring, nurture aura energy about you, Scorpios. And this person misses that. You were their peas. You were their peas. And all you ever wanted to do was for them to literally see eye to eye here. And they couldn't. So it's like there's some regret, guilt, shame where it's like I want to come in and just swoop you off your feet because I'm starting to understand our connection, Scorpios. Yeah, and I want to do it with no hesitation, no fear. 
It's like, I'm sorry I didn't make you happy. For some of you, moved on to another commitment. You know, you're just seeing if this person is dealing with their karma. <laughs> you can clearly see they are here. All right. Again, watching you on social media. And again, not meeting you to where you wanted them to be. That's why the King of Cups is in reverse. It's like, again, they're giving you a page, right? They're giving you a cup. But they never gave you that King of Cups energy. You, they never could amount to the love that you were giving them. And that's why they're saying, I realize I didn't hurt you. I realize how bad... I didn't realize how bad I hurt you until now. So it's like they want to come off with a simple text message for some, like, hey, how you doing? I'm just checking on you, but they feel stupid if they do that. I know I was a distraction from your pain. Um, I'm so attracted to you. Look at your social media. It's time for me to heal. And I hate who I really am from you. Wait, well, yeah, wondering, this is like key to Scorpios. Wondering, wondering who has your attention. And then the thought of you with someone makes them angry, like, man. Well, you 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 had me and you blew it. They're actually wondering like who you're with in an intimate sense. And they miss that with you and it's driving them nuts. I'm just going to say that here. I have the King, Ace of Pentacles with Justice card. If you're dealing with the Libra here, um, they're still unstable. Like they're trying to be balanced. If you're dealing with the Earth and they're still showing some type of uh, unstableness here where it's going to be like an illusion type thing. Because again, all right, Andrew, this Ace of Swords is coming out. You can see the Justice here. So, um... Don't trust their words, trust their actions, right? Right now, uh, we are, again, new moon and Capricorn energy, trying to build structure in our lives here. And I also feel like, you know what, they're wondering, you know what, if someone has your attention, well, that's my loss. And I want to see you happy. I want to see you win. I want to see you marry, even if it's not with me here. I know I'm going to take this loss forever and know that, you know, I'm never going to stop loving you here, Leo energy. And it's like, you're going to be the one who forever got away, Scorpios, unfortunately. Yeah. They're trying to just be patient. Yeah, they're trying to be open with you. And addiction is affecting this relationship. This is more so, and addiction can be so dramatic with this card, right? But this person is just really, really overthinking about things. So if you're feeling restless right now, Scorpios, like, uh, it's, it's not you, it's them. Again, that's why I'm saying ask other questions. If you do talk to them, don't dismiss the red flags here. I also have an awakening. Someone's undergoing spiritual transformation. You give them the spiritual lesson. And that's what I'm saying, too. Like, for some of you, Scorpios, you're going to you know talk to this person see what happens here but build the friendship up don't just rush into some passionate night of uh ace of wands energy with this person i know it's a attractiveness but don't do that i have time apart some distance will help bring clarity and i'm not available this person is unable to give you all that you deserve it's focusing on self-care self-love to clear your energy field and focus on yourself before acting and stability here create stability for yourself forgiveness forgiving yourself for another will help you move forward yes or feels because you know we all have free will you can listen to my reading and this person comes knocking on your door and you just forget but don't deceive yourself you know this person was showing a mask or you're about to find out they're showing a mask here okay and some conversations that you guys are going to have and then some of you you're going to free yourself take back control of your life start loving on yourself and again a new love is going to manifest soon all right guys i'll see you next week